Acupuncture is commonly used to treat chronic pain. However, we know does it not work for every pain patient. Because of this, it would be helpful to identify patients for whom acupuncture is likely to be more beneficial. This might in the future support to stratify patients to different treatment groups to provide a more appropriate treatment, but also to increase efficiency in healthcare. To identify patient characteristics that influence acupuncture effects, we used a large database with individual patient data from nearly 40 high-quality randomized control trials. Patients participating in those trials suffered from chronic pain, including nonspecific back and neck pain, shoulder pain, headaches or osteoarthritis. For all those patients, information on age, sex, pain duration, pain severity before treatment and psychological distress were available. The question was, does any of these characteristics has an influence on the size of the acupuncture effect? Interestingly, only the baseline pain severity was found to have consistent moderating effects on acupuncture outcomes. Patients reporting more pain at baseline had a higher benefit from acupuncture than those with lower levels of pain. The patient's age and the pain duration, however, did not seem to influence the acupuncture response. The baseline psychological distress might have a small moderating effect. However, the size of the effect is not clinically relevant. Based on this analysis, the current evidence provides no justification to stratify patients to groups that receive or don't receive acupuncture treatment. Here, further research is necessary to identify perhaps other factors that influence the acupuncture treatment outcome. If you want to read more about this analysis, I invite you to visit our recent publication on the Clinical Journal of Pain.